Hello, welcome to Kaylin's Toys. Today, um, we did the time lapse videos, and this is part five, and no more bags. We have the thing itself, the Lego City thing. Well, I wanted to include the pets because I really like them. So here we have little bird. They turn it all around. I like how they use that. But well, in most sets, it's called a penguin foot. So I like how they use that penguin foot. And the relatively new orange uh, big cheese piece. I'm also talking about cheese piece. It has a cheese piece on the front. And um, let me just another bird which is quite top heavy that's why i had to put it on a man's hand detailing all around it looks like a toucan of some sort yeah and i really like that detailing all around i had it <laughs> i didn't realize that was that white piece there so i just knocked the accessories over and there's that man looking this way detailing all around unfortunately not on the arms and he doesn't have a face. That's the one you know alternate faces on any of these because it's normal Lego. Normally on Star Wars sets they have alternate faces. And after that we have a little dog actually with a clip. So for example, <laughs> this is going to be really funny. This is not what it's meant to hold. It's meant to hold anything. But for example, it looks... You can hold a mobile phone. That's one of the accessories. <laughs> okay, I'll put that close up in a minute. And after that dog, we have a mouse, which actually has mouse holes in here, but um, but the mouse doesn't fit through them, which is quite a shame. And you can't even fit through it. Not even a little bit. And uh, looks like a granddad with detailing all around, not more on the arms, but on the back. And, uh, and it's the hair of Grandmoth Tarkin in the Death Star. So I really appreciate using that hair. And with the little stumpy legs, a little girl. Detailing all around, oh, just dropped it. Detailing all around on the arms and the hair piece. So, I just want to show you that. <laughs> I really like that. And now, let's move on to this big boy. I think I might have to get this close up to the screen. Um, very close up. Uh, I think I might, I might need to move to the end of the table. Um, wait a second. Where's my iPad in the background? Let's move that out of the way. Oh, there's all my figures. These are things that I've been reviewing and not putting away. Right, here we are back again. <laughs> And now to this big boy. Whoa, okay. that fire hydrant for block. Uh, talking about fire hydrant. So on the front we have a nice balcony with an open door. And if I move it out a little bit, um, there's a coffee shop in here. There's the outside bit. And if uh, that's the coffee symbol, you. I built that the way that I built, put that the angle that it was meant to be built, but <laughs> you can put it whichever angle you really want. So maybe I don't know what this is, um, maybe a street lamp of some sort, up and down. So like if a bad guy was trying to climb up that coffee, could, uh, this could just whack him. <laughs> oh, uh, and it can also spin. 
and I really appreciate that. And turning around to the other side, we have a pet shop. A China, a pet shop. Well, I really like how they did them pets on the outside. A traffic light, which can actually move up. So, like, if a bad guy just climbed up there, you could just whack. And, yeah. Unfortunately, they don't light up like proper traffic lights do. And these can slide. There is no door, but there is a, a stopper here. Um, but on the main side, this one can come out as well, which is quite a shame. But I like that. And I need to move this even further out the way to see the solar panel dish. It can go up and down. don't think it's really meant to. Meant to. So there. Uh, my tongue got twisted. <laughs> And yeah, now let's move on to the inside. Turn this around. So there's the sliding doors from behind. Let's see what they look like from behind. Yeah, I like that. And on the top, we have a bedroom with green and thick and yellow things and the bottom one isn't the same as the other ones the other ones are just flat but these are studded so you can put someone on there except for the little girl she doesn't have studs on the back of her legs she has them stumpy feet which i don't really like and on the bottom level here we have a sofa and a tv i can actually we can turn this tv and looks like they're watching something coring Maybe the Grand Prix, <laughs> like like Daddy does. Um, we have a sofa. There's loads of detail. There, there's a bedside lamp, lamp, and the uh, there's a the mobile phone's meant to go there. I really appreciate that. Um, and here. Yeah. Uh, and oh this this part I really want to show you let's get this really close up. look how much detailing there is they're, they're parrots <laughs> I really like the use of them parrots and we have some kitchen room here I have to eye on the camera because because it's so close I can't of it that's the thing to turn around that's the thing to turn in the coffee shop and yeah there's a little sink and microwave and a balcony which you can actually open the door to let me just do that that can open the door and you can actually get a person to stand up there there is some studs and some flowers which we've never had before just want to take one of them flowers off yeah i like them flowers but this is a New thing I'm doing it on and there's two dots so I don't know which one's which so yeah this is new for me. And yeah I like that. Um a little balcony on top and as that has does she we can place her figure up there if you place her right on the side she can go diagonally. And yeah I think that's good. Um there's loads of detailing. I really like their microwave. It uses a clear piece and yeah, I really like it. Also, I want to go back to the... Oh, first, let's show you the inside of the pet shop. That's the pet shop. There's a... Oh, knock the flowers off. Poor flowers. There's a bird stand, if you can see right there. Yeah, you can see though, I just looked through the screen. There's a bit of cheese, and if I just get that mouse that I showed you earlier, he could, he has some studs and he can pretend to eat the cheese, which I think is really good. And there's a fish in the tank, not much to swim in, nearly as big as the tank. I think that's meant to be a toy fish, I'm not sure. But 
for an overall cell, I think that's good. And there's a balcony here, if you can see, there's some plants. Um, yeah, I really like that. Also, what I want to show you is on the outside. I'll have to pick the camera up for this. On the outside, there is some studs right there. So we can like place any of the accessories, like maybe I need to wait a sec. Like maybe the dog or the mouse or the bird or the yeah, and one full up with a fire hydrant. I really like that fire hydrant. Also, you could take that off and pretend that there is a leak and if you have a blue fire piece you can put that on there for a change to look like there's a leak. So I really like that for an option to change a thing. And yeah, they're also really easy to come off if I just put my finger on one of them. They a little bit harder, they fall off. Also, there's a menu side there I really like that and let's show them parrot pieces on there pulling up a stuff came with, off with them but there is a oh i have a really stingy folds okay there is a parrot i really like how i did that and there's also some drain piping here, which is attached to a thing, so you can like take this off and pretend there's like a, a thing that's happened and it has gone wrong with the. I like that. I moved the wrong thing. It's pretty hard to get on. I uh, there we are. And yeah, I think that's really good. Also, the cash machine. Um, I think the cash machine is full up with a stud, isn't it? The cash machine, for a shelter, um, they actually use a, a, a Lego seat, if I can show you. Yeah, the whole thing came off with it. Let's take that off. It actually does use this for a shelter like that. And then it just clips onto it. I really, 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 really appreciate that. And yeah. I think that's pretty good and this is 9 plus just to let you know <laughs> I'm only 6 and yeah I think this is pretty good and let's show you the accessories and um, okay. mobile phone i really like that mobile phone detailing all around and it's just like an a hundred dollar and i don't think this is meant to be a proper accessory but for this you can like uh, if if there's a flat piece that you want to come off you can use this to flick it off i don't know whether that's meant to be a, a thing or not maybe it's an accessory maybe it isn't and uh, that's an accessory always important a cross on detailing all around it also has them lines i really like it <laughs> and last but not least the hot dog <laughs> and it actually does come with a hot dog let me get that hot dog hot dog hot dog hot dog hot dog <laughs> There's a hot dog on the big hot dog. I want to take that off to show you. 
Look at that big hot dog with some pickles, some mustard, some ketchup. Yeah, I really, 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 really appreciate that once again. Let's see them slide the doors from the front. I think that's really, 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 really good. That's the other one. And yeah, for a nine plus set, I always give more figures, but yeah, before we say it again, bye bye. And but before that, we can, I will just say, um, we're gonna do a time lapse video of taking this apart because because that's why it's nine plus because you have to like take everything apart and you're like hmm which pieces do i need so probably the next time lapse thing what we're doing on the video is probably gonna take us a long time but first i want to show you the instructions which are over here, just want to tell you how many pages um, we took to build this whole thing. So let's see, all of this, all of that, all of this, all of that, all of that, all of this was ages. Oh yeah, two dolphins, blah blah blah. What two dolphins? I think we missed this place. I think. Oh no, you go too far. Right. <laughs> so I'm just finding the. It took us. It took us about. How many pages? Are Oh, this is really annoying me. Right. Uh, no. Oh, go, go all the way back to the start again. Bed. 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 The bed was the top one, wasn't it? Yeah, the bed was the top one. So it might be about this page. Still going on this page. It's this one. I got to this one. It took us. I just need to make sure the piping's on that one. Let's see. All of that together. I definitely need to read this out to you. I found the page. Finally, it is 168 pages it took us to build this. That is a lot. And I also want to actually show you the instruction book. It, it definitely is a... You can't really see it, so I'll just move this big boy out of the way. This it is a book. Um, uh, 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 uh. Yeah, the three one or that. And also, if you go into Lego Life, if you have it, if you don't want to flip through all the pages and go into Lego Life, scan this with your phone and then... You can actually build this on Lego Live and it'll flip through all the pages for you. Yeah, I think that's really good. And yeah, thanks for watching this video of Kaylin's Toys. If you like this video, give a thumbs up. Bye! And don't forget to hit a like.